I was a dancer for a while. I used to dance for Naughty by Nature back when they were in a new style. I went to high school with them. I said, it was, we were in, immersed in the culture. We're not really understanding what was going on. But uh, when I started writing more seriously, it was right around the time the, the record started selling. So I'm like, man, shit, as a dancer, I'm saving people from getting booed. So if they can do their thing and blow up, then I should be able to do the same thing. So following the lead of a Naughty by Nature, but keeping my roots as a teacher and an educator, I went over to KRS-One, and you know, the rest is history. I met KRS-One um, from the education lane. I, I was a school teacher for four years in Jersey, 90 to 94. I, my, myself and two friends of mine started an after school program called African Children of Tomorrow Now. And part of that program involved us taking students to see different lecturers, Dr. John Henry Clark, Dr. Ben, Ivan Van Sertema, KRS-One, when he had Human Education Against Lies. And then through dialoguing with Chris before and after lectures, asking him certain questions, he just got, to used, to, got used to seeing me. And then when he came to Montclair State, which was the college I was at at the time, he saw me and said, Hakeem, I've been looking for you. And, and I want you to open up my lectures since you're an educator, since you are a teacher. We want you to speak on, you know, the, the application of education in the system, how, it is, how it's applied. So I ended up opening up lectures for Chris. And then a year down the line, I hit him off with a demo tape. And that's how the music relationship started. So, you know, connecting with Chris, knowledge, five elements of hip hop culture, emceeing, DJ, break dancing, graph arts, knowledge. That knowledge element is very important. And that's how I really got my start in the business of hip hop culture. Hip hop is not just rapping. Hip hop is multiple elements happening at the same time. MCing, DJing, graph arts, b-boying, or the expression of knowledge in your art, right? So when we focus on just the money or the business of the rap music, that's not necessarily respecting hip hop culture. So I, mean, I would like to see more MCs, more rappers. Rappers get thrown away, by the way. The rap, take the rapper off, you throw it away. Um, but I would like to see more MCs, lyricists, rappers include more of the elements of the culture in their artwork, in their videos, in their performances. Yeah.